hey everybody welcome back to my channel thank you for clicking on this video so today before we get started I just want to give a big thank you to pop voice they are sponsoring today's video and this is a lapel microphone that you can hook up to your phone or to a computer or laptop to record sound or to use as a microphone I'm going to leave a link to their Amazon page in the description box but basically it comes like this and it comes in a nice little pop voice pouch and you get a six foot long cord you get the microphone and the label the lapel um, the little fastener and it comes with an extra piece this piece is what goes into your computer or your laptop and then it comes with extra little covers for the microphone it's a great product to have especially if you're going to be filming outside or if you need to do voiceovers or anything like that it's a wonderful product so pop voice check them out let's get to this video okay guys so i have seven days until vacation who's excited i'm excited ignore the messy background i couldn't figure out where to put my bag so i'm going to actually just sort of give a real quick overview of what we're taking with us because my goal for this trip was to minimize what we were taking so i packed for me and my husband all in one bag crazy right because y'all know how we do around here we balling on the budget i have everything planned out i'm gonna tell you about it so one second okay so i'm gonna give you a quick update on what's happening so mister and i are going to florida and then we're getting on a cruise ship we're cruising to the bahamas on a two-night cruise on the bahamas paradise line and we're going on the grand celebration ship and then we're going to go to Miami once we're done with the cruise and we're going to a wedding and then we're going to um, Lake Helen Florida to spend the night at my sister's house so we're flying down on Delta and you can take one carry-on and one personal item for free but then we're flying back on Frontier and you have to pay for a bag on a frontier which was why I wanted to put everything into one bag so we only have to pay one bag charge because these bag charges are ridiculous and we're balling on the budget you know so we're trying to keep all our costs down so what I'm gonna do first is talk about my carry-on bag and I'm gonna tell you all how I've been trying to minimize things so I'm gonna take this book bag because you can take that as a personal item it'll fit under the seat and what I've done in the big compartment I've actually put our shoes that we're going to wear for the wedding so I have my shoes and I have mr. shoes in here and then in the the main compartment I'm going to have my camera my handy tripod my extra batteries and my battery charger and then I have um, always carry an ink pen. Never know we need to write something down. <laughs> and I have my camera, which I'm not really sure I'm going to use. I'm thinking of playing around with just only vlogging with my phone. I'm not really sure yet, only because my laptop is broken and I don't have an editing system on my husband's laptop. So I have to decide if I want to purchase a new editor or find a free one. I don't know yet. But anyway, also in there I'm going to have like our headphones cell phone chargers things like that like my little mini purse I have our cruise um, papers for boarding that'll stay with me and then I have a train schedule because we're going to do the tri-rail and um, so I have that to figure out how to get from Fort Lauderdale to West Palm Beach and then from West Palm Beach to Miami and then um, once we get to Miami we're actually going to take an Amtrak to where my sister is <laughs> so there's a lot of travel going on in there but little mini things like that will be in the carry-on backpack okay so here's our bag I'm not going to go over to you know pull out everything because I got it <laughs> I got it in here how I need it but I will tell you exactly um, what is in here this is a uh, adapter so we can plug up our devices that way and then um, so in this compartment I have mister's 
under things and then this one I have mine and then hold on so inside the suitcase we have the outfits that we're gonna wear for the wedding it's an all-white wedding so we will be wearing all white and then I have two bathing suits for each of us and then we have like three casual outfits each or we're gonna mix and match tops and bottoms stuff like that and we have like one nice outfit each that we'll wear the second night of the cruise for dinner and you know like to take some pictures or whatever and then um, once we get to my sister house if I need to then I'll wash some of the stuff that we can use for traveling home to wear to repeat an outfit something like that and then this here and it's so cute I actually won this from Sharon at sea and it's a wet bag it's supposed to be used for your bathing suits like after they get wet but I like to use it to hold stuff <laughs> so this is my everything bag and then in here I just have some jewelry that I plan to wear um, on the ship like for the fancier dinner and for the wedding so I have um, two different jewelry sets for that and then just the basics travel toothbrush and toothpaste and then I have some lotion and some shower gel not even doing a whole lot because we don't need a whole lot and then um, I have this for my phone if I want to get in the water with it and take some pictures or some video so you put your phone in there and it stays dry and it has this connectors like if you want to listen to music or something like that or to plug in but I don't think I would need that and then the last thing I have in here is my emergency kit um, so I'm, I try to put stuff in here that we might need just in case I'm always doing just in case they have some Imodium we have some Benadryl some gauze pad and tape um, and band-aids and things like that just in case I need to redo mister's wound area from his surgery I have a flashlight just in case we lose power on the ship <laughs> I have some safety pins a highlighter um, I don't know if this cruise line does like a daily paper like Carnival does, but I do like to highlight some things when I want to go so I don't forget. So I have a highlighter just in case. have some alcohol swabs and some liquid band-aid. Just pretty much everything as a just in case. And then also, um, before we leave, I will put in my husband's prescription medicines as well in here. So we have his medicine so he can take and honestly like that's it we're so not taking a whole bunch of stuff this time because i just feel like we're going to be on the move so much it's just a short two night cruise one night in west palm beach one night in miami you know we'll be at the wedding so and then we'll be at my sister's house so anything we really would need we can get at my sister's house and things like that so it's definitely a minimalist trip everything in this one bag I do wish I could find a weight <laughs> to make sure it's not too heavy but mister also can take on a personal item so if we need to take a couple things out of the suitcase and put in his personal bag then we will do that as well just in case so it's not too heavy but I think we'll be good because we don't have a lot of stuff so I think we'll be okay all right there you have it i'm so excited we will be out of here in seven days and be sure to subscribe if you are not subscribed to see all the adventures i will be vlogging the entire trip of course and i have a lot of people who said they are interested to find out about the bahamas paradise cruise line so if there's something specific you want me to capture let me know in the comments below and i will make sure that i get that for you i'm hoping to squeeze as much in in these two days on this ship that i can like a tour shows everything that they have to offer I want to try to get so I can really give a good review on it because some people have said that they might want to try and I will see you in my next video don't forget to give me a like hit that subscribe button thanks for stopping by